We are the 99% and you are the 99% probably. Yeah, that's one of our battle cries at Occupy. <laughs> one of our slogans, we are the 99% at Occupy. It's not really a battle cry until somebody tries to start a battle with us. Because that's what battle cry means. It's not a battle cry unless it's used in battle. Which, which sometimes, pretty much has happened sometimes when people attack us physically. But anyway, you know, enough about the physical attacks at Occupy. I'm going to show you something, something interesting, something that I'm going to do, something funny that advances the Occupy cause. Let's, let's check this out right here. See, right here, this is, um, this, this right here, see this, see this, this is a, a business reply mail from the a Love's Gas Station and Food Mart. It's, it's from the Love's uh, Gas Station and Food Mart chain, and this is from their store in, in Purcell, Oklahoma. Because I was there a few days ago, because I went on a trip to, um... Let's get that thing out of the way, right there. That's another thing I want to deal with some other time, that thing over... Well, anyway. So, so anyway, I was at the, the Love's in uh, Purcell, Oklahoma a few days ago because I went storm chasing. This is a storm chasing trip. And we, I stopped by this uh, gas station food mart and I was using the restroom and they had a big stack of these. They had a big stack of these business reply cards for the Love's uh, store change. No postage necessary if mailed in the United States. So you can mail them for free. You don't have to pay postage on them or anything. It's for Love's travel stops and country stores. And, um, and anyway, these, I used to, back in the 80s when I was growing up, we used to have to get these, like, at, mostly at fast food restaurants used to have these. Remember, these were surveys you could fill them out. And we used to fill them out funny. We did. We filled them out funny. We put funny answers down on there. Like, for instance, name, Ronald Reagan. Address, 123 Sesame Street, Ridiculousville, Nebraska. That's what we would do. We would do stuff like that. And it, it was, restaurants had them. One place that had them was the Bob Evans restaurants. They had those. And, you could, and they had a mailbox right in the store. You could just drop them in there. They had like a, it wasn't like a real professional mailbox. It was like a, a mailbox that was inside the restaurant. And I, I think Zantigo's used to have them. Remember Zantigo's that got took over by Taco Bell? But here's what we do now. This is a good way to get the 99% the Occupy message across. is to write, we are the 99% big letters on these. So I found one of these in the I got this in the in the restroom at the Love's uh, gas station, and I sm there's a big stack of them. And I smuggled them out, and I stowed them safely in my travel bag. But I'm gonna put "We Are the 99% in blue ink. Yay, my blue pen still works. We are. The 99%. See, see that? We are the 99%, and you are the 99%. See, and I'm gonna mail it. I'm gonna mail it because it doesn't cost anything to mail. And it's gonna be cool. This is it loves, not L U V S like the diaper. I mean, I, I mean L O V S like the gas station change. The diaper is L L U V S. We're showing loves some love. That's right. And from now on, every time I get these, this is what I'm gonna do. Instead of filling it out funny, I'm gonna put "We are the 99 percent." And this is what I encourage everyone to do. I encourage everyone to do this. And not only that, I'm gonna get my. Let's see if this still works. This is my green highlighting pen. 
See if this still works. I haven't used it in a while. Yeah, it still works. It still works. Sort of. I think I've had, I think I've had this since college and it still works. Because I take care of stuff. I'm going to highlight it. I think the last time I used this table to, to write stuff for this uh, feature was, was when... Uh, when I did the Tom Selleck thing, remember that? I drew the, I defaced the drawing of Tom Selleck because he likes cough drops. No, that wasn't, uh, I don't really care if he likes cough drops, but that was to, to make a point. And the best, best all, when this is going through the mail, the, the mail carrier is going to see all this. And they'll be encouraged to to act in support of the 99%. Mail carriers, they're part of the 99%. Mail carriers aren't billionaires. There, and I highlighted it by doing that. We are the 99%. Another place where you can write this is on dollar bills. You can write, we are the 99% on dollar bills. Get my blue ink pen back out. I've got a big collection of pens I've gotten from like hotels and stuff. Because I'm, Tim's a traveling man. That's right. You know, sometimes if you go to like a, on a trip somewhere and you stay at hotels, I try to minimize costs. Okay. So there, we are the 99%. I'm gonna mail that as next chance I get. Boop. There. So. So that's the. That's that's what I did. That's for, from a, that's a suggestion like a a business reply card from the Love's Gas Station in Purcell, Oklahoma. It was Purcell named after Sarah Purcell. Remember Sarah Purcell from Real People? So, I think there was a, there might have been an episode of Real People where Sarah Purcell bubbled. I'm not sure about that though. I know there is one where the, where the kid from the Messy Marvin commercials bubbled. But remember that? <laughs> it, it was the kid from the movie where they say, you'll shoot your eye out, kid. He bubbled in an episode of Real People. Well, actually, I think it was a spinoff. They had a spinoff called Real Kids back around, like, 1981. And he, that's, that's where the messy Marvin kid bubbled. They had a whole feature once on bubblegum. And about how people bubble with it. But anyway, that's, that's the story of uh, Business Reply Card.